Alright guys, welcome back to another video of this channel. Please hit that subscribe button and let's start the video. Okay, so this video is going to be like a multi-step process. So we're going blackfish um, fishing on my kayak, but that's in a couple days now, but we got to get crabs first. So we're going out to the store to get a crab trap. I just got to put on my slides. So you coming? No? Alright guys, look at all this new stuff I got. Like a chest mount, head mount, some weird thingamajigs. Tape measure, a kayak, another GoPro, mouse, ah. Just joking, I'm not driving. <laughs> it's illegal. All right guys, arrived at the first location. So this is uh, Hilliard's Bait and Tackle, uh, Niantic, Connecticut. So uh, yeah, let's go and put our mask up. Here, here's the, um, the sign real quick. Alright, let's go in. Alright, Mom, what are we getting? Chicken legs for your crab trap. I thought they're for you. I'm vegetarian. Actually? Yeah. Alright, let's go. <laughs> Alright guys, so we have the uh, the trap. We got some knife and uh, scissors. We got some string and zip ties. And uh, so we got this smaller trap. So uh, all you need to do is just this little clamp right here. And uh, it just fits on here, and then you undo it like that. This comes up. You just hang the piece of chicken that we got here from uh, BJ's, and I don't know, I might zip tie it or uh, tie it to a string and then put it up there. And then the crabs walk in through here, and then they can't get out. So, uh, yeah, there's a uh, open the chicken right here, the knife. Probably should be using my hand with a glove on because I don't want to get salmonella. So I have this chicken here, and uh, I don't know, let's just grab this piece too. I think I might zip tie them, or I don't know how this is gonna work. I think I just might zip tie them. Yeah, it seems to work. Once they're defrosted, they'll become better. And uh, just take scissors, clip this open, and uh, yeah, I think I might tie some string or, you know what, let's just stick to the zip ties. Um, bear with me guys, I'm not the best at this. Okay, we got it. I'm just going to put this in like this. Sorry if the camera angle is not the best. Just gonna dangle it down like this. I think that should be good. That the crabs can't get it if they're up here. So uh yeah, and then um just close it like that. I might trim up this a little bit, but uh yeah, it's pretty much baiting it done. So uh yeah, I'll put it in the water and then uh get some video of that and then uh we'll pull it up next day and uh see what we got in it. All right, guys, so we uh, arrived at our marina, got the crab trap with the uh, chicken in it. So I uh, found a line in my shed to uh, attach it to, just pull it up, make things a lot easier. Um, so yeah, let's go down there and uh, show you guys what's up. All right, guys, so we arrived at the boat and uh, was tied a few uh, slip knots to that. And uh, yeah, we're gonna put it down. Um, there's already a few crab trap pots here. So uh, there's like a couple going down, have some uh, fish in them and crabs in them. So I think I might put mine over here. I don't know. You know what? Yeet. Sorry guys if you couldn't see there, but uh, yeah. So uh, now we're just gonna tie it and then uh, go home. So uh, do you guys wanna tie it? All right guys, so we uh, put the trap down and give it a little torch um, so it would uh, not snap and then, uh, yeah, so it's down here. So we'll give it like two days maybe and then we'll come back, so. Uh, yeah. All right guys, so just pulling up the crab trap. This is Two days later, I ended up moving it because uh, 
it was just getting in the way of everything and uh, some people started pulling it up so I was like you know what I'm just gonna move it. I mean it's not a lot but better than nothing I guess. This has only been like 48 hours so I think yeah I need to lower the chicken a little bit because the crabs aren't really getting to it but uh this guy's this dude's trying to escape look at this you can't escape little buddy and uh but if we keep getting the sizes like this dude we'll be in good shape dude stop <sighs> damn it alright just get this guy in. Man, this guy's claws are pretty big, but uh Oh we have this little guy. He's decent size, female, good green green crab bait. All of them are green crabs, I think, except for this one. I don't know what type of this guy is. What is this guy? That dude is just like a crack. That dude's claws are absolutely huge. Look at that, guys. This cannot be a regular green crab. Let me know down below in the comments what kind of crab this is. Looks like he's covered in some type of a moss or uh, algae or something. But damn, those claws are absolutely. Oh, okay. It's going back in. Well, I uh, hope you guys like the video. Uh, please hit that subscribe button and the like button. Uh, really helps me uh, out. And uh, yeah, I'll see you in part two of this video.